Imagine being teleported to the least private and most crowded place on earth and being forced to live there. What would your day-to-day -day life be like? The Dharavi slums in Mumbai are currently home to the densest population anywhere in the world you can find. Just two square kilometers of this place are occupied by 700,000 people. But what if you were teleported to a location that was considerably overcrowded? In 1993, a little community in Hong Kong called the Kowloon Walled City formerly held the title of being the most populated location on earth. As you might expect from nicknames like the City of Anarchy and the City of Darkness, life was somewhat chaotic in this location. The population density of New York City is just 10,431 people per square kilometer. So that should give you some indication of how congested it was. There are more than 277,000 people living in Dharavi for every square kilometer. However, Kowloon Walled City was astonishingly 182 times more densely populated than New York, with 1.9 million people living there every square kilometer. Imagine if everyone on the planet coexisted in close proximity like they did in the Walled City. It is possible for the whole human race to coexist and operate in Rhode Island alone. But what was it like to really reside in such a horrifyingly crowded place? Without any valid operating permissions, the ground floor was crammed with dental and medical offices. Dog meat was frequently made available in restaurants as a tempting substitute for other foods, all without following any hygiene rules. You needed to bring an umbrella to protect yourself from the drippy water pipes and people tossing trash over you because the passageways were just three to six feet wide. The walled city, which lacks any recognized government services or even laws, was effectively the biggest squatter colony in the world. Police, or anybody for that matter, would only ever interfere in big groups or never on their own since it was a dangerous area to enter. People who resided here were frequently persons who society rejected, like gangsters, pimps, drug traffickers, sex workers, or even some regular, possibly insane people who recognized an opportunity were among the individuals who frequently called this place home. For a 40 square feet room, the average rent paid by each resident was 35 Hong Kong dollars, or roughly 5 US dollars per month. In conclusion, the Kowloon Walled City served as a test of how long people can survive sharing a space with one another. It was a place where individuals were free to live whatever they chose, no matter how hazardous or chaotic that could be, and where the rules of civilization were disregarded. Even if it wasn't the ideal way of living, it was a monument to the human spirit's ability to persevere in the face of difficulty. Living in the most populated area on the planet would be difficult and it would need a lot of resilience, tolerance and flexibility to live and prosper. However, the Hong Kong government chose to destroy the city in the 1990s and its people were moved to public housing estates. In its place now, the Kowloon Walled City Park is a reflection of the city's distinct and interesting history. So there you have it, the crowded location on the planet. Can you see yourself living in such a location? Tell us in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more amazing content. As always, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video. God bless you all.